What's up everyone, Sprite here, and today I'm back with a weekly challenge. So, this is another one of uh, Grounded's bounties. Uh, I think it's from, yeah, I think Habs actually made this, but then Grounded added the honey. So yeah, both Habs and Grounded's links to their channels will be in the description down below. Uh, anyways, I'm doing a uh, another voiceover after I uh, record it. Because I thought this was gonna take a long time, and I then I could just like record uh, a bunch of tries, and then yeah, then do the voiceover later. But I actually got this on my first try, so yeah, that's pretty crazy. Actually, we are here in turn three already. We got one win, and uh, we level into giraffe, but unfortunately we can't buff anything that we need later with the giraffe yet actually we can we can just sell and here yeah that's what we do so worm is one of the pets we need let me just bring it in here and yeah worm is gonna be pretty crazy because it's gonna it's gonna generate apples of course so worm kind of buffs itself and then we get a level up like immediately after so that was kind of lucky and we put the worm up front because it's the most attack and hp now and then we come against this uh, cricket horse team but we can draw luckily And then, yeah, we still only got our worm. And then I'm thinking about horny, but I'm just gonna wait with horny. And beaver level up into nothing that I need. There isn't a tier 4 pet that I need actually, so yeah. Then I freeze worm and garlic for next turn. Uh, yeah, but I'm gonna try to find the horny later because I still only have one win. And, and horny is probably just gonna work against me right now because there's a lot of camels uh, yeah hippos peacock I love that and it's just gonna help them and then I was trying to freeze the worm still but then I get another one immediately after and then there's a cricket we also need cricket I could have frozen the other cricket for a level up in case I find penguin but I didn't do that here and then this term worm just takes out the entire team. Thank you, worm. So we almost have worm level three now. And we, yeah, we will start buffing, buffing cricket now. And I'm thinking, thinking about penguin, but it will only buff the worm. But I'll, I'll just take out the duck anyway and buff the worm so now cricket and worm are both getting some scaling then my entire team gets sniped immediately but the stats on this team are not really good even though he had a I don't know if it was level 3 hippo but it got 6-6 six, six from a knockout so that's pretty crazy for for turn 8 uh, yeah, now I actually do want to bring in Cricket, especially when I find another one. Because then Penguin is going to be really good. So yeah, already a 22-22 Worm. And then here we face a boss, which is pretty funny. We are going to take him out though. And then his name was also ended on Sprite, I think. I just saw that. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Here we take out Skunk for Gorilla, because we also need Gorilla. Getting Gorilla on turn 9 is really good, actually. Because that means we can just scale it a lot. That's a really lucky find from the level up. Then, he has one big bison, but our worm is just even bigger. And our, our entire team stays alive. So the, the apples are still good, the two, two uh, gold apples. 
Then here's level 3 worm already. So we're gonna get the best apples now. And then there's monkey. And there's two honeys in the shop, so... Yeah, I really need the honeys. Because now we're... If you we win this, we're on... Yeah, on seven wins, so... We need some honey rapidly. And we actually do get the win, so... Yeah, seven wins. So... I have a lot of stuff frozen that I need right now. But for now, I will just... Take the apple and one honey. I'll put it on cricket, yeah. Because I'm still scared of, like, big hippos or camels up front. And the bees are just gonna help them. But yeah, coconut get, gets activated. And it can take out a few units. And then worm just cleans up. And then we find another monkey and another gorilla. So yeah. I'll just take both of them. Actually I can't because <laughs> I don't have enough money. But then, yeah, that's it for this turn. And Gorilla's gonna be crazy with Coconut here. So, yeah, that was actually a huge turn for Gorilla. But one big problem, we are on 9 wins. So we need, like, Horny still. And we need Elephant still. So yeah, in this turn I can maybe find something. I can't remember. So there's a gorilla that I'll freeze. And then, then there's the elephant. So I'm trying to put it in an order that will make me lose. And yeah, I successfully do it. And then there's scorpion in the front, so it's... Would have been the best to put worm up front actually. But then the, the boar gets really big by our summons here. So that's really nice. But we still need uh, two more honeys as well. And then there's one. So I'll put an elephant. Then... I was hoping to find another one, but I can't, so I'll level up Gorilla, I think. No, I just keep running for honey, and then there it is. I'm not leveling up Gorilla right now, because it's gonna be better, and I don't want it to be good right now. And then putting Elephant in front of Gorilla actually is a bit of a mistake, because it will, it will activate Coconut on Gorilla, and it will be a bit stronger. But luckily, there we made this big kangaroo with our summons. So now we have everything that we need. And then, yeah, I just put everything in. Then I roll a bit. I don't need chocolate because, yeah, I just can't level up anything in, like, Max two turns. So I'll put it in the right order. We send it. And we come against this big hippo. And it's just gonna be <laughs> generating health by all of our spawns. So yeah, here it is. it's a bee and a cricket and it just gets n plus nine plus nine in every knockout. So yeah, we get destroyed. And yeah, at this point I'm uh, I'm a bit worried. Because I was, I was hoping to uh, get the win already. We were on four hearts. When we only needed like the elephant and honey. And now we're on one heart. And then I take pear over the sushi. So I can target it on gorilla. And then I send it again. And we come against this fairly weak team. We get the coconut on gorilla. And we take out like the big units. And then yeah it's over. Because our worm is so big. And then there it is. The weekly challenge flashback bounty completed. Did you guys enjoy? 
please like and subscribe, leave a comment down below. I'll leave a link to Hubs and Grounded channel in the description, so check them out as well. Later.